<clears throat> so we are going to sketch a graph of um, this right here, and uh, y equals 6 over x minus 2. So first off, let's look for any asymptotes that there might be. So one of the things I know about asymptotes is I can't divide by 0. So looking at that, x minus 2, that denominator, when that is 0, plus 2, plus 2, x equals 2, I have an asymptote there. I have a gap in the graph where I can't, um, I can't graph there. So let me get start of a graph on here. I could probably use tools to make that straighter, but oh well. So asymptote, um, x at positive 2, so that's right here. So I'm going to make a dotted line right here. And again, what that means is there's a gap in the graph at that spot. So um, let me get at my other one. It, as x gets really large, as x in, approaches infinity, what does y do? So thinking about this 6 over x minus 2, as x gets really, really, really big, um, I basically have 6 divided by x. You know, it's minus 2, but... That just means I'm just a little bit off. But really, this thing tends towards 6 minus x. 6 divided by a million, 6 divided by a billion, that basically gets, gets on down to 0. So it doesn't equal 0 ever because um, you know, it just gets closer and closer to it. So that means that I have an asymptote here at y equals 0. In other words, as x approaches infinity, y approaches 0. So now I have those. Um, I notice I'm not going to have, um, I'm not going to have an, an x-intercept because my x-axis is an asymptote, but I will have a, a y-intercept. So let me figure out what that y-intercept is going to be. And uh, in order to find that y-intercept, I'm at x equals 0. Um, because it has no left or right, and it just has this up and down. So... Uh, x equals 0, I'm going to plug it into this equation, 6 over 0 minus 2. Uh, 0 minus 2 is negative 2. 6 divided by negative 2 is negative 3. So when x is 0, y is negative 3. So it'll go through the point 0, negative 3. So that is 1, 2, 3 right here. Let me label it. 0, negative 3. And I can plug in some other points, but for the most part, I know what this is going to look like. It's going to look like this. And I can plug in a point up here if I wanted, but... That's what the graph that's going to look like.